Hello, I'm Mandy. In today's video, we are going to do two simple experiments that you can do with the kids in your classroom or your kids at home. Whatever you are um, working on in school or at home with your kids, these can just easily be um, integrated into your day or your curriculum because they are very simple and they are using things that you can find in your pantry um, or even probably at your school as well. All right, so in honor of St. Patrick's Day, we are using a lot of colors like the rainbow. Okay, our first experiment, you will just need four glasses um, filled with water, three small bowls or glasses. Um, I am going to be using a dropper. Um, this is great for young children as well because it works on their fine motor skills. Um, so you can do that or they can just pour, whatever works best for you. And then also at least four colors um, for this experiment. Now, you will want to have four different colors, red, blue, green, and um, yellow, that you can use to show how colors mixed together make a new color. So to f start off, I have red and blue, and all I'm going to do is use my dropper and squirt some red and some blue into the same bowl. Now, this is fun for the kids because this is something that they can do easily. Have a spoon, mix it together, and then they will find that they've made the color purple. All right, and then this is something you can walk them through or they can do on their own, kind of experimenting, see what the colors make on their own. Um, it can be done in multiple different ways. All right, and then yellow and blue. Of course, make the color green. All right. And you can do this with small amounts of water um, to control the amount of water that each child has, or you can give them, um, if you're outside even, that's a great way to do this because it's um, less messy and it gives them the room to experiment a little bit more. Okay, and then of course, lastly, red and yellow to make orange. Like I said, this is super simple, super easy to do in your classroom um, or at home. And it just is an easy way for them to see how colors mix together. Okay, today's second experiment um, has to do with colors as well. Now this experiment is called walking water. The water will move from one glass to another, but also with this experiment we're showing how two colors can mix together to make a new color as well. So great for young children as well. You can throw it into your curriculum and um, set it up and let them watch it throughout the day as well because it's going to take a little while for the water to move over to the, next, uh, to the other glass. I have three full of water and three empty glasses. So the first thing we're going to do is use our food coloring and put yellow in one of our water glasses. Quite a bit, make it very yellow. Red in another. Okay, and then lastly, blue. Okay, now I'm going to stir this up. Each one, just make sure it's nice and even. Each color. Okay, next you will need some paper towels. What you are going to do is take your paper towel. I'm going to fold it long ways couple times like so because you want it nice and long I'm going to stick one end in this cup with water and one end in the empty glass okay as you can see it's starting to move up the paper towel okay, I'm gonna do this for all of my glasses
All right, now we wait and watch the water walk to its new glass. I'll see you in a little while to show you how this experiment turned out. Thank you for joining me today to see these experiments. They're very simple experiments, but fun things that you can do with your kids. Um, check out my other videos that will be coming soon with more experiments. And I hope that you enjoyed this. If you have any ways that you would do this experiment, maybe improve on it some, feel free to tell me in the comments. My email will also be posted below if you have any questions or um, any ideas on further experiments that I could try as well. All right, I will see you next time. Goodbye.